Creativity can take you a long way. It can even drive you to open a new business. And this next Warren resident did just that. With her new venture, Fruit Creations, Kristen Sklad has more on this Warren Biz profile. Today I'm joined by Gift and she's the owner of Fruit Fantasy and Fruit Fantasy is based in Warren. And can you tell me about what your company does? It's very interesting. What we do in our company is very simple. First of all, we want to try to encourage kids, adults that don't like eating fruits mm -hmm. by bringing in different kinds of fruits. By this way, we are motivating them with our creations that we put together mm -hmm. to encourage others, young, old, whatever age you might be, to eat whatever fruit it is, as well as using our centerpiece as a wonderful and an artistry um, creation mm -hmm. for everybody to see for whatever the event might be, a wedding, um, baby shower, just name it, we do it all. And what we also do, we incorporate some Thai carvings, mm -hmm. that way, you know, to make to make it more beautiful, mm -hmm. you know, for whatever the event might be, like it, I mentioned earlier on. Right, and these arrangements are very elaborate. You brought along one here today, and it is just gorgeous. Yes, thank you. And how did you get involved in this? What made you like this type of work? Um, actually, my my degree is in healthcare mm -hmm. administration. The vision came to me about six years ago mm -hmm. when I gave birth to my. I was in my hospital room. I gave birth to my little ch boy, still birth. Mm -hmm. And this will be my third lust. Mm -hmm. And the vision came to me. And my husband actually initiated it. Mm -hmm. he, wanted, he doesn't like any fruit. You have to put it into a smoothie, blend mm -hmm. it up. Mm -hmm. And this day I gave him some fruit. And he said, make it interesting. Mm -hmm. So I went and took a watermelon and carved it into a, a little basket and gave it to him. And he ate it. And I thought, why not? Mm -hmm. And from there on, I just started, you know, taking upon myself, whoever is doing any occasion, mm -hmm. I make myself available. Please, can I do the fruit? Mm -hmm. And before you know it, I started studying about it. And, and you were saying you, I am today. you do not plan or map these out. It just no, comes to No, I didn't. Wow. It just came to me. The greatest vision, the, the biggest thing about mm -hmm. this was that the day I had my breakthrough was through my childbirth. Wow. Very five, nice. uh, six years ago. Very, very nice. Thank and you. And you said any occasion these are for? Any occasion. Mm -hmm. Weddings, we do weddings. We do any occasion. You can, we even do little baskets mm -hmm. that you can give, you know, to someone to say thank you. Mm -hmm. Or weddings, like I said, mm -hmm. funerals, whatever your, your, your event might be, mm -hmm. we'll do it. And do customers pick the fruit or you choose? Um, customers can pick the fruit. We deliver. We can deliver and that would be an extra charge if mm -hmm. we do. The only fruits that they can pick up are the baskets. Mm -hmm. Now, if you want a big, uh, the bigger creations, that we have to take to the location to um, create. And what are the price ranges for the creations? The price ranges from $25 to whatever how big you mm -hmm. want it to go. It can go up to thousands. It depends on your your uh, creation but like a little table arrangements that's a 250 and people can go to your website and they can see all the elaborate creations at www.fruitfantasy.com and there are even strollers on there carriages there are baby strollers if you want a um a baby's a, a character uh -huh. say for example a princess elmo mm -hmm. Carved on a watermelon, you know, we can do that even on a platter. Mm -hmm. If you just want a platter and you don't want a big creation, mm -hmm. we can use that as a centerpiece mm -hmm. and carve that on there to make that little princess happy or that little son of yours <laughs> happy. So we do it all for whatever the event might be. Yeah. Great. And you, as I mentioned, you did bring along an elaborate TV Warren display today and you were yes. going to carve something to add to that yes, display. Yes, I am. And so what are you going to carve? I am going to attempt to carve a little floral um, display from this uh, honeydew. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to, what I'm going to do after carving that, I will incorporate that to the uh, creation that I already made on the side. Mm -hmm. So technically what I did, I just drew out here um, my little uh, template to get all the little floral, the leaflets mm -hmm. out of the floral stuff. Mm -hmm. And um, I, as you can see, I started one already. Mm -hmm. And um, I'm just going to use my little concom knife. This is like my best friend. Uh -huh. <laughs> so really, just carved out. It's pretty easy. Mm -hmm. And how long do carvings usually take or it's always varied? Um, it varies. It varies. If it's, um, if I have to carve a character, you know, it varies, like I said, because the carving takes a little longer. Mm -hmm. 
depends depending on what it is. Mm -hmm. So if you ask me to carve Barney or something, mm -hmm. you know, if it's just the carving, then it's not a problem. You can pick that up in 30, 40 minutes. Mm -hmm. But if I have to do a full creation, it all comes together mm -hmm. as a big package. Mm -hmm. So that's why it takes time. It's the arrangement from the arrangement of the fruit mm -hmm. to the creation. And I see that you're drawing little petals. We can already start to see the flower. Yeah. And do you make these on paper ahead of time? Do you draw these creations? No, I don't draw these creations. Uh -huh. um, as I'm talking to you, if it comes, mm -hmm. I just do it. Wow. Um, and I just try to learn and I watch other people see what they do. And what I do is I try to figure out how I can incorporate this to my creations. Mm -hmm. Being that I don't just do just the carvings, what I do is instead of just laying down fruits, mm -hmm. there's no need to just lay down fruits. Let's make it interesting mm -hmm. by incorporating something that will make it make it lively and interesting mm -hmm. for everyone to enjoy and mm -hmm. make that event you know very eventful mm -hmm. very nice so, and i didn't ask you this how long have you been how long has fruit fantasy been in existence fruit fantasy as a business fruit fantasy has been in existence for two years this is going to make it um yeah two two years is this 2013 yeah it's going to be <laughs> Three years. This this will make it our third year, but we've been doing this for six years now. Right. Very nice. Yeah. And I, you actually have a customer here with you today, and I wanted to bring her on set. Yeah. Thank you. And her name is Doris, and she actually bought something from you, correct? Yes, I did a creation for a baby shower. Mm -hmm. Hi, Doris. Hi, how Hi. are you? Hi. So um, you have bought fruit from Fruit Fantasy before. Yes. And what did you think of it? I thought the piece was really well prepared. Mm -hmm. um, the fruit was really sweet. Mm -hmm. You know, sometimes you buy your fruit and it's not as sweet as mm -hmm. you may want it. The fruit was really sweet. She prepared it right. She was on time. Mm -hmm. So I, I enjoyed it. And how did you hear about that company? I actually Googled it and I, I it was my baby shower mm -hmm. and I wanted something elaborate for my first baby. Mm -hmm. And I Googled fruit, mm -hmm. you know, creations. Mm -hmm. And she popped up and I'm a Warren resident mm -hmm. and I seen that her business was located here in Warren. Mm -hmm. So I contacted her. Wow. And so you got rave reviews at your shower. I got the... great reviews. Um, I sent business her way. So yeah, everyone was really impressed. Mm -hmm. So you have yeah. already made recommendations and you will continue to go to Fruit Fantasy yes. in the future? Yes. Great. Yes. Well, Doris is, I'm, I'm, thank you, Doris. And thank Gift you. is going to keep carving, but we thank, thank you for coming on today. And remember Fruit Fantasy, you can check out their website. Thank you. Whether you're starting a new business or maintaining an established business, if you're in retail, you can't help but notice the industry is changing with new technology, social media, and how